Okay. Good morning. It's clearly morning because I'm drinking coffee. Delicious coffee. We're going to get a few things straight here. One, Phil is a bully. Established. He's also a thief. He's had my chair for like two weeks now. Fucking chair thief, Phil Lamar. I hope that's what it says uh, on your headshot. Phil Lamar, chair thief. Um, however, it was not Phil who attacked Sad Sad for being a fucking vlog. That was me. It was not Phil who said, let's ask questions. That was also this schmuck right here. So if you have a bone to pick with either of those two things, direct it to me. Not the bully. He may be the muscle, but I am the asshole. Um, okay. Now that that's out of the way, uh, it was also I who extended the invitation to the great Dean Cameron. And, uh, I'm so thrilled that he, he actually uh, made a video, uh, that he was able to post it <laughs> after some technical difficulties. Um, but, uh, uh, Phil, I believe you're right. I believe Dean has uh, been the titular star of more uh, films than, than anyone else. Um, among those, I just want to throw this out there, and I said this to him once, and I think Dean thought I was fucking with him or I was joking or whatever, there's a movie he made called Miracle Beach, and yes, it's a silly movie. But if you know it's a silly movie, if you're not expecting Citizen fucking Kane, it's really funny. And, uh, and Dean is very good in it. Um, my favorite thing, though, that Dean ever did, and Dean, I don't know if you've done the show live recently, uh, but I do know that some version of it exists on, on either DVD or audio or what have you, because... I've seen it advertised in the back of uh, old issues of Skeptic Magazine. Um, he, he is a show that he put together called The Nigerian Spam Scam. Um, I'm not going to describe it in detail. This is not uh, a commercial for Dean's show. But it is one of the funniest things I've ever seen. It is so wonderfully creative and um, uh, a, a, a great, truly unique... Uh, take on um, on something that at some point we've all dealt with to some degree, and uh, and it still makes me laugh to think about it. And my my brother and I talk about it all the time. Anyway, fucking seek it out. You will really you will be doing yourself a, a great service to seek it out. Enough of my uh, blowing Dean Cameron. Um, Lynn, come on over anytime, buddy. That wall of DVDs, which is in fact meticulously organized, awaits your arrival. Oh, I'm so close to the camera. Um, what else? I think that's all I got for now. Um, ooh, there's a lot of ums on, on this one too. Now you have me all conscious about it. My hair is very messy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I've had this cough. I got a cold last week, and um, and I get colds like everyone else, you know. I get it, and then I feel awful for like two or three days, and then on like day four, day five, I'm pretty much better, and day six, I'm like back to normal. But what separates my colds from everyone else's is because I have this awful asthma um, for the two to three weeks following the sixth day, I will have this lingering cough that is just terrible. And, uh, and it scares everyone around me into thinking that I'm still sick, but I'm not. I don't have the cold. I can breathe through my nose. I'm fine. But uh, the cough is it's fucking deadly. And uh, and that's what's going to kill me when I'm older. It will not be the cold. It will be the lingering after effects of the cold. Morbid thought, eh? Um, oh, wait, that's what I wanted to point out. On my last video... Uh, the question that I posed to all of us, which was in earnest, what would you do if you weren't an actor, if you weren't in the entertainment field, is really more what I meant to say. 
Um, and I, uh, somebody asked if I was joking when I said I'd be a welder. Uh, I am joking. Uh, I, I don't know how to weld. Um, in fact, I don't even think that's my joke. I'm, I'm 90% sure that that is a joke that Tom Hanks makes in the movie Punchline. Um, but the real answer to that question, for any of you who are curious, and I'm sure this is mostly the sad, sad watchers, not the, not the posters, uh, I would be a pharmacist. Pharmacology fascinates me. Um, and, uh, and I would like to have the power to dispense drugs. But, um, oh, fuck, I just forgot what I was going to say. Jesus, it's too early for this. Uh, all right, this video's gone on long enough, and I apologize for that. Oh, that's what I was going to say. Uh, I'm going to set the over-under, uh, on, at, at zero, for how many more posts we get from B.D. Wong. No, I guess I'll set the over-under at one, and I'm going to take the under. I don't think B.D. Wong will post again. And if he does, the magic word is shiitake. Nobody help B.D. out with the magic word. If he watched this, he'll know.